And I thank God every day that I got through that because ooh, I wasn't promised. You know, you never promise. And being able to say, you know, what you went through, show what you went through, tell what you went through, help other people. It, I guess, my testimony and a blessing. Sorry. Because like I said, I had it bad. I had pneumonia, didn't even know it. I was in ICU the first day. And then I was moved to a room. But being able to talk about it, and even though it probably gets on people's nerves, I find it a blessing. And so I try, when people, I hear people that has COVID or is struggling through COVID, I try to give them advice. I try to help them because a lot of people are saying their doctors are telling them that it's all in their head when they have some kind of symptoms. It's not. People are literally having side effects from this. I don't know how I got off subject. <laughs> Went from praying to, you know, talking about COVID again, and, it, and it's always, um, I don't know why, I tend to still talk about it. And like I said, it, it could be my testimony. It could be just somebody needs to hear this. It could be, I don't know, you know, because not everybody know about a COVID program in their state. There is COVID programs. You don't have to go through your doctor. Yes, you, you can get a referral from your doctor, but if you look it up, like here in Texas, it's like UT uh, COVID program that I'm actually in, and they will help you with a lot of stuff. They will refer you to different doctors, and they're not going to say it's in your head. They're going to run tests. They're going to talk to you. They're going to ask questions. And um, I know Tina Marie, we all know Tina Marie, she had it, just had it. And I tried to talk to her and I told her if she needed her, her doctor to get in touch with the COVID program, you know, uh, there's here in Texas, because I know she was having a problem because she has a little asthma. Sorry for talking about you, Tina Marie, I don't, don't mean to, but that's just how I try to help people. That's just how... I don't want nobody to suffer. I don't want anybody to just think they're crazy because somebody told them they're crazy. Um, but anyway, I don't know. I'm just, I just thought I'd get on here. This is my first time getting on live and I might tend to do this every so often to get online to talk or anything. Cause um, like I said, I wasn't the type of person that would get on in front of people and talk. This is new to me, but hey, I'm beginning to like it and everything because um, it helps me and it really does from what I hear of other vloggers or YouTubers say, this really helps because you get feedback. Some of it shouldn't even be a feedback because some people are such negative person and we're supposed to all be here to uplift each other. We're all supposed to be here to bless each other. And... Whew. I think I said enough for today. <laughs> so I'm going to get off and I thank you for joining me or looking at my videos. And I just hope sooner or later that, you know, I can be more where I used to be. Well, not where I used to be, where I know God plans for me to be. And, oh, I... Talk to y'all later, guys. Thank y'all for joining me. Thank you for making comments and everything. Uh, I know I look horrible, but like I said, been out in the sun. I have to get up every day. So, um, until nighttime, not nighttime. Stay cool, stay warm, wherever you may be. You know, cold com climates and warm climates. Um, and y'all be blessed until next time guys bye i don't know how to turn this off so this is how y'all know i'm new i i try to figure it out it's crazy okay